And instead of sitting there and wallowing in my sadness and my frustration, and it will take my frustrations <laughs> out on my massage clients. And that sounds really bad. Jess Constantino, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey everyone, I just heard some really great advice and it is from actor Michael Caine, uh, the legend Michael Caine, and he has this video he's talking about in his career, he was taught to use the difficulty. Use the difficulty. Yes, use the difficulty. What does that mean? Well, yeah, I learned, I got it from, a, a, I, was, I was rehearsing a play when I was a very young actor. And I had to come in this scene, it was a stage play, um, things, and he, he threw a chair and it lodged in the, in, the, in, the, in the doorway. And I went to get open the door and I just got my head round and I said, I'm sorry, sir, I can't get in. He said, what do you mean? He said, it's, it's a chair there. He said to me, use the difficulty. I said, what, what do you mean? He said, well, if it's a comedy, fall over it. If it's a drama, pick it up and smash it. <laughs> he said, use the difficulty. Now, I took that into my own life. There's never anything so bad that you cannot use that difficulty. In, if you can use it a quarter of 1% to your advantage, you're ahead. You didn't let it get you down, you know? That's my philosophy. Use the difficulty. Also, the added philosophy is avoid them if you can. <laughs> <laughs> and he likes to apply that to his life. And this is a philosophy that I really, really like understand and feel like I can get behind. It's something that I actually try to do in my own life. And it's just something that I wanted to come on and talk about because I think that it's really important to understand that if you are having a bad day or a difficult day, I know some of my viewers have talked about, you know, just going through a really hard time right now and myself I'm also like going through a really hard time I'm very stressed the last month or so and I just have a lot going on and what I do to kind of keep me going day after day after day even though one day is bad and then the next day kind of builds on it mm. feels like everything's hopeless after a while. And I hate that feeling of feeling hopeless. These are feelings that I have had very frequently in my life. And I don't like feeling that way. So one of the ways that I choose to get out of that funk, that state, is by doing exactly what Michael Caine suggests, which is use the difficulty. If you are having a bad day or if something goes wrong, figure out how to use it to your advantage. Figure out how to make the situation your own so that you're not feeling out of control and you can do something positive even though something negative happened. Like take a positive out of a negative. And the best way to get a positive out of a negative is to figure out how to use that situation for your benefit. Uh, if I'm having a bad eye day and I can't see very well and I'm in a lot of pain, I use that pain as motivation. I will say, okay, I'm having a bad day. It's hard to get up. I can't see. I want to like be crumpled in a ball on the floor because I'm in so much pain I can't handle it. And instead of sitting there and wallowing in my sadness and my frustration and just feeling like very low from having this situation, I will take it and say, okay, how can I use this to my benefit? How can I use this to help myself? And the good thing about my career is that I'm a massage therapist. So what I like to do is I will take my frustrations out on my massage clients. And that sounds really bad. I don't hurt my massage clients unless they want to have deep tissue and ask to be hurt. I will like go after knots and like get those knots out so that I can get out my frustrations. And especially when somebody wants deep tissue massage, that's very easy to do because if they want a deep tissue, they want those knots gone. <laughs> So I am just very happy to grind in there and get those knots out for them. Um, it takes out my frustrations. If I'm having pain, I can 
you know, turn it into something positive. I can get something out of it, you know? It's just, it's a way that I turn my day around or turn my situation around. And so I just wanted to come on here and share that with you guys because I think it's such a valuable lesson and such a valuable state of mind to put yourself in so that you can take the best out of every situation that comes your way. As people with disabilities, we often have difficult situations come up in our everyday lives. And what better way to look at those difficult situations than to say, hey, I'm gonna take the difficulty out of this. I'm going to take the difficulty and I'm gonna turn it into something positive so that I can do something good and, and help others and help myself in the progress. So. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you got something out of it, don't forget to leave a like and don't forget to subscribe if you wanna see more content like this. Thanks for watching everyone. Love you guys. Yes, sir. Blind Pineapple Production, yeah! yeah.